Hi bro, if you're interested in projects that right now or in the future can bring a good profit, you are where you need to be. My name is Daniel and today I have found a project that is extremely suitable for these purposes for you. But before proceeding to it, I want to remind you, in any case, conduct your own project reviews and analysis, even after my videos. Vault Inu is a hyper-deflationary token whose aim is to invest in multiple asset classes such as NFTs, nodes, altcoins, staking and farming of stablecoins. Since Dollar Vault is intended to be a hyper-deflationary token, profits made on treasury investments are then used to buy back and burn Dollar Vault tokens. Let's first look at what the Vault Inu is based on. Automated Social Activity Rewards This tool incentivizes the involvement of Vault holders by implementing a ranking and reward system according to the number of tasks completed to increase the exposure of Vault. NFT Ecosystem among others, the NFTs will be directly linked to the Vault token as it is, for example, will be required to hold them in combination with the token to get access to the launchpad and other features in the future. Swap DEX Swap will be accessible to any DeFi project by using existing liquidity pools on protocols like Uniswap, PancakeSwap, ETC. Launchpad Given the impressive growth of the Vault community since its inception, the development of Launchpad or Incubator was a natural step. Considering the size of the Vault army, it can bring a very interesting input and exposure to new and promising projects. In addition to the main functions, Vault Inu developed their own game and here's what is known about it. P2E Racer Vault Inu 2D Racers is a browser-based online game where users can enjoy play for free races and pay to play for projects which they can choose and or create before paying. The intent of the game is to get prices in cryptocurrency for being highly positioned in the different leaderboards or to compete for a project to make it earn a buyback and burn. Vault Inu also has many partnerships. They have various gaming collaborations as well as partnerships in sports industries, metaverse industries and much more. By the way, Vault Inu has its own collection of NFT and in my opinion, they look just amazing. Let's turn to the tokenomics of the project. It is distributed on both networks and has these following indications. Tokenomic, ETH, 1% reflection, 2% liquidity, 2% automatic burn, 4% marketing and development, 4% treasury. Tokenomics BSC, 1% reflection, 4% burn, 4% marketing and development, 4% treasury. And for convenience, Vault Inu presents us with a dashboard where we can view all the detailed information about the token. By the way, please note that both contracts have been verified by one of the most trusted auditors, Solidity Finance. Well, in conclusion, let's take a closer look at all the achievements of Vault Inu, of which they have a lot. I've been following them for a long time and here's what I managed to find out. Very soon they will have a swap, Volic Engine. Despite the current situation in the markets, they continue conducting marketing campaigns in real time, and they do it just fine. The results are not long in coming. Mauro Boselli is now an official Vault ambassador. Just imagine, as I said earlier, Vault Inu pays great attention to its partnerships, and now they sponsor five UFC fighters among men, as well as the first UFC fighter among women. It is very cool. Over the past six months, the guys have really achieved a lot. 26 CEX listings, 9 DEX listings, 3 fired gateways, dozens of partnerships and sponsorship, a P2E game, 50k plus holders. And the latest global news, Vault can now be used to pay in 3 jewelry stores in Vegas. I think you can be sure of the scale of the project. By the way, the team talks about all their news on Twitter. I studied it with great pleasure. And don't forget to join the social networks of the project. There are already more than 16,000 participants in the Telegram chat and the latest news and interesting posts are published on Twitter. Well, that's it. At the moment, I already have several projects that I want to tell you about and they will definitely appear in my next videos. Thanks for watching me and leaving comments. Do not forget to tell me about some mistakes if I make them and of course, to suggest projects that you have met.